Hi, welcome along to Arsenal Fan TV. Now, I've got a question. Why is it that Lucas Perez is not starting more games for Arsenal? Why? I really want to know. This guy, we bought him for £17.1 million. He's come in and he's hardly played for Arsenal. Let's face it. And I'm mystified as to why. I mean, every time he has played for Arsenal... He's looked very, very good. He's looked dynamic. He's looked very physical. I like his work rate. I like the way he tracks back. And he scored goals. I mean, take a look at his record so far this season. He scored seven goals in 18 appearances. And remember, he's only started nine of those games. He scored a, a hat-trick in the Champions League against Basel, which is no mean feat to score a hat-trick in the Champions League. He scored, remember, that vital goal that he scored against Bournemouth um, when he came on. So, why is it that Lucas Perez has hardly started? He's, he's a, a left-footed player. We have problems on that left-hand side. And when he's played out on that wing, he's been very effective. You can also play him down the middle. And I, I'm, I'm just mystified by the whole thing. Listen, I know that Alexis Sanchez, for me should be the guy starting week in, week out, down the middle. For me, my first choice to start. I know that when Giroud's come off of the bench, he's been a very effective, so sometimes he's earned his place starting as a centre-forward. But what I don't get is why Lucas Perez has not started more games when the guy has come on, he's looked so effective. Now, if you look at the team... Arsene Wenger's preferred to play Alex Iwobi. That's the guy that he's kind of liked to play on the left-hand side. And don't get me wrong. Don't get it twisted. Iwobi has done brilliantly for Arsenal this season. He's a young player. He's really coming up. And I think in years to come, you know, this guy's going to be one of Arsenal's best players. He's an excellent player. But why does he have to start every week? Alex Iwobi is not a prolific goal scorer. Um... I reckon that what Wenger obviously likes with Iwobi is that he's a ball-carrying player. So he's a guy that he can carry the ball from one end of the pitch to the other. He can take on players. He's very tricky. But he doesn't score as many goals as somebody like Lucas Perez. Now, what I like about Perez is that he seems to have a little bit more discipline in his game in that he protects the left-back a bit more, which is something that Iwobi's not great at doing. He works really hard. Um, for instance, if you've seen when Arsenal played, like, say, and you've got Alexis, uh, Lucas Perez, and, say, a Welbeck in the team, you see how they press much better. And he's just... I love the directness of this guy. He's a direct player. If he gets the ball and he's in range, he will shoot and he will have a go. And that's what I like. And that's something that we lack at Arsenal. The only person who's, who's like that, really, is, you know, Alexis. So why does this guy not start more games? And we heard the rumours a few weeks ago where his agent had come out and had spoken to the Italian press and said that he's really unhappy. Um, he wants to go and play in Europe. You know, he wants to get into the Spanish team. That's his ambition. And he's not getting any game time at Arsenal. And uh, he wants to leave. The agent did come out after that and deny that and say that he didn't say that to the Italian press and that Perez is not looking for a move. But certainly at the moment, you know, he must be unhappy that he's hardly getting any game time, especially when you think that, you know, Welbeck's been out injured for a long, long time. And we paid £17.1 million for him. He's been kept out of the team by a young player like I Iwobi. So I just look at this and I think to myself, from now till the end of the season, we must give Lucas Perez more game time. I think this is a guy... That, for instance, the game against Liverpool coming up, I'd start Perez. I really would. Every time he's come on, he's done something. I would start Lucas Perez. I would start Danny Welbeck, right? I would start... I, I, I gave this formation for the Chelsea game and I was saying that, you know, I'd ha either have a Walcott, say, on the right, Welbeck on the left, Alexis down the middle, or if not Welbeck on the left, then Lucas Perez on the left. Go dynamic. Go... Have goal scorers on the pitch. And I think that Lucas Perez deserves a start. Because remember, Welbeck can also play on the right. He's not actually um, like a left-footed player. He can actually play on the right as well. But Perez has to get more game time. There's more games now from now till the end of the season. Let's start seeing more of this guy. I don't know why we haven't been giving him more, you know, game time. I think Iwobi 
who's done, as I said, brilliantly. I love Iwobi as a player, but we could give him a little bit of a, of a rest right now and start playing Lucas Perez. That's just my opinion. What do you guys think? I want you to let me know what you think of Lucas Perez. Is he an Arsenal player? Is he good enough? Because certainly at the moment, when you look at the selection of him so far this season, it would appear that Arsene Wenger doesn't think he's good enough, but I don't know. Let me know what you think, um, but I want to see Lucas Perez starting against Liverpool.